They took a very dangerous person off the road. Now at five, an arrest and an ambush attack on an L.A. County Sheriff's deputy. The sheriff saying that suspect has a violent rap sheet. Good evening and thanks for being with us. You're watching KCAL News at five. I'm Chauncey Glover. Hi, everyone. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Susie Sa in for Pat Harvey. That motorcycle deputy was shot in the back while on duty. He was wearing a bulletproof vest and is going to be OK. And investigators say they have 47 year old as 47 year old man who is also a known gang member in police custody. KCAL News reporter Lustelia Caballero has the very latest on this arrest. Please make no mistake about this. Our next priority is to get this individual prosecuted to the full extent of the law. LA County Sheriff Robert Luna announcing 47 year old Raimundo Duran has been arrested in connection with the ambush shooting of a uniformed deputy in West Covina Monday. They took a very dangerous person off the road. Luna says Duran was initially stopped by the California Highway Patrol Border Division in San Onofre. On suspicion of drunk driving and weapons possession charge, he was booked into the San Diego County Sheriff's Jail. He was discovered parked at a location in a 2008 silver Toyota Camry four door. Adding Duran is a known gang member and based on prior convictions had no business having a gun in his possession. He has a very extensive criminal history, uh, a very violent criminal history. Sheriff Luna says detective work and collaboration with different agencies led them to connect Duran to Monday's shooting that happened at the intersection of Barranca Avenue and Garvey Avenue in West Covina just after 2.30 p.m. while 43-year-old Deputy Samuel Aispuro was waiting at a red light on his marked motorcycle. The situation could have ended so tragically. The nearly 20 year veteran of the department was wearing a bulletproof vest and the round never went through his protective gear. That vest saved our deputy's life. At this time, we're told Deputy Aispudo has visible injuries to his torso due to the impact of the bullet hitting his vest. He's currently recovering at home with his family. Reporting in downtown Los Angeles, Lustelia Caballero, KCAL News.